Hey everybody, I'm Gavin Good, and today we're here at Irwin Practice Facility to talk to Charlie Young and Cameron Wells, two people leading the charge for Illinois Baseball's new look at analytics. It is collecting everything from how hard the pitcher throws to where it's in the strike zone to how much movement it had from when the pitcher released it. So it tracks where it was let go as to when it ended up in the catcher's mitt. And then if the batter puts it in play, it'll track where it went, how hard it was hit, and all the batting statistics that go on along with that as well. So it's mostly off the cuff stuff right now. We're not really getting into deep into the analytics because we don't really have a lot of solid data yet since the season hasn't started. Uh, but hopefully when the season starts with all the websites and database stuff built already, we've got to hit the ground running and see what the coaches want to see, see what we can see and go from there. They are like always looking over. So like after they're not bad, they'll come over and say where those pitches were, what like Jack Yalowitz is all about, like his launch angle, where is, where is he, how high he's hitting the ball, how hard they're hitting it. And then like if a guy gets a hold of one and like puts it up over there in the corner, they're like, how far did that go? And like everyone runs over yeah. and looks over your shoulder to see the screen. It's pretty funny. There was one time with, I think it was Brian Half and Brent, Brent Spillane. I think Half hit a ball that was like 100 off the bat. and. Brand got in and it was like probably 95 and half and started like, hey, I got this better than you. And then they got in a competition where it was like one pitch, who can do it better? And they went back and forth, back and forth. Uh, I think half won, I'm not entirely sure. But yeah, I mean, they've, they've been totally interested, involved, they've been asking the numbers, but that was probably one of the high points when everyone was like cheering when half won. It was a pretty fun time. We're with uh, sports technology at DIA, uh, we're finding a lot of data initiatives. We're doing this for all different sports. So like soccer, volleyball, gymnastics, basketball, and now baseball too. We're all hopping on this like data-driven decisions to help our athletes. And so it's super cool to be like the pioneer on that forefront. I, I don't think I, I, I would have a job uh, in baseball this summer had it not been for what I'm doing here. So I think it'd be good both to win and both to help students kind of get more involved and kind of build up their credentials to go into the industry. Um, and maybe even for the players, if when, when they get drafted, go play for a team, they'll be familiar with all these numbers. Maybe they'll have an advantage over their other players because they know how to treat these numbers, how to work with the analytics. So I think it's a pretty good experience for everyone involved.